god, the bloody cat is on the ironing board and now I have fucking cat hair all over my shirt. Lovely. Today is a very exciting day because I'm gonna go buy a new car. I didn't do the best job of ironing, but um, I tried at least. Uh, what's been your longest relationship? Why did it work out? You know, just like, like they're just like this tick, 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 tick. Like it's like, it's so much pressure. Are you guys ready for the city of Adelaide with our one building? <laughs> the one skyscraper of Adelaide. <laughs> Not sure if it's an actual city or if it's a country town. What? Subaru? Am I going to Subaru? Am I going to Lexus? Where am I going? I'm going to Toyota. Where am I going to go? There's Ferrari down there. Where am I going to go? What do you guys think of Lexus? Look at that yellow. Hey, the crew. Hey, bro. Hi. What's up? Yeah. You're gonna be acting today. Am I? Am I acting? Yeah. I'm buying a car. Am I? Yeah. I'm getting a Lexus. Which Which one? Do I get to choose which one? Look at all the gear we've got. We've got a nice little. Look at this gimbal. Oh my god! We've got a massive tripod. Big, big camera. Now this isn't an ancient camera this time, is it? No. Nah. Nah, this is an actual. This is FS700. So it's not the FS7, but FS700. Right, what does that mean? And it's Super 35, so it's a high dynamic range, 14 F-stops. Wow, 14 F-stops. That's crazy. It's full frame, definitely it's Super 35. This place, this place is massive. I would have, I don't know how they get the cars down. It, the stairs, the stairs aren't very big. I don't understand. Oh, what? Look, they've got a driveway. How cool is that? <laughs> They've got a ramp in the bloody building. And it, there's another level. Oh my god. What's up there? Do you reckon I'll get in trouble if it, there's more Lexuses up there? Maybe this is where the staff park. Maybe. That's cool. Wow. Wow. So I guess they just... Look at all these cars I have to choose from today. Do I want an SUV? Do I want a sedan? What would I like? This one's cool. This black one. Yes, what? That's fuck, that's sick. It's like greyish, but it's like sparkly. Oh my god. Can I get in it? Oh my god. How cool is this? This is oh. Alright, this is the one I'm getting today, boys. Bring me up. Here's my credit card. You've got a very nice steering wheel and it's like futuristic. You've got a ring in here. That's cool. Wow. I'm not sure what this stuff does. Very, um, this is very like sports car S. The, it feels like you're very like boxed in, like you don't have a lot of room in here, but um, that's cool. Oh, sport mode. Yeah, chuck it in sport mode. This is, this is actually really nice. I would bring the seat forward a bit, though. Just adjusting it like I'm going to drive out of here. My, now, if you see my head, I wonder if the seat goes down. Is there a switch that I can bring the seat down? Uh, hello? Here we go. Oh, here we go. I'm going down. You go forwards? Yeah, my... I think that's just my hair though. My hair's sticking up and it's... Actually, I'll just go like this because there's a sunroof. Oi. How cool is that? Ugh. That's sick. Which Lexus is this? This is a... This is a 300. I think downstairs is where they have the, um, the cooler. The cooler cars. The guys over there are just... Um, they're just packing the stuff up really quickly and bringing it downstairs. See you then. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, 
see. So make sure. Because I feel like it's not working out. You look nervous, Alvin. What? You look nervous. Yeah. Is it gonna work? <laughs> I reckon I'll buy that red one. Yeah. What do you reckon? Yeah, here's what I'm talking about. This is a cool one. I don't know whose car this is. This is a privately owned car. Oh my God, look at the exhaust. Oh. I'm not sure about this. This is very like Galato-ish. Carbon fiber here as well. What would you guys go? The, this yellow one or the red one over there? I reckon the, the red one, to be honest. This is really cool. Maybe if this yellow one was in black, I'll go this one, but. What makes uh, Lexus unique compared to uh, compared? Thank you for having me. My name is Wade Sander. I'm the general manager at Lexus of Adelaide. I've some backstage passes and an opportunity to meet the guests after the show is as well. And then indeed, on top of that, there are exclusive Lexus opportunities that on my telephone. <laughs> Oh, I'm not in this scene, unfortunately. I'm in the next one, though. Okay, okay, yeah, boy. Oh, you've just done it. How good is that? I'm That was legit. I didn't even realize they were rolling. One of the questions, you just pause and then I know that you finish and ask the next question, basically. So I'm in this state, we'll try and make the closer. Hey, Chell, you. Good, Good to you see you. It's time for the new car. No way. Oh yeah, my God. <laughs> nice. It's a campaign they're running. Oh, I've got, got the keys, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we do everything. <laughs> Hey, hey Mitch, how are you? Good, good to see you again. Yeah, good to How's see your day, man? Good? Oh, really good. Yeah, really I'm, good. I'm doing this, um, this movie thing. Like, yeah. Okay. And then, come on. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> how was that? Yeah, so cool. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. I had to keep giving the giving the keys away, I didn't like that. Like, then you keep good. this camera. Maybe I'll, I need to I need to just buy it I reckon. Okay. Gotta hydrate. I find when you're really busy in these awesome film sets, these film days. You can sometimes forget to drink your water, so drink up. How much acting experience do you have? Oh, about that much. <laughs> okay, we're going for the take. So, name and role at Lexus of people here at Lexus of Adelaide. Of course, we provide the, the genuine Lexus experience. We both together work on the camera and light. Film crew. This definitely matches my outfit. Look, I'm back at uni. I went to uni for like two weeks. Just two weeks? Yeah, just two weeks and then I just oh. stopped going. <laughs> Hi. What we got front, back. So this is like the red one that was on the, the showroom floor. This is like the coolest car I had. And so next thing would be... How many are you gonna get to the get to the gym, bro? You're gonna lift some weights. <laughs> and then you can operate gym more longer. We had to um, there was a lady moving from da so sorry from Darwin to Perth, okay. so she sent the car down to Adelaide and then Adelaide via train to Perth. But for the car to so she was packed, the car was full, heavy, slammed, and um, for it to fit onto the train carriage, it needed to be a minimum clearance of 13 centimeters, and it was about 12.1 centimeters, so it wouldn't fit on the train. So we had to remove these two weights, which were part of her belongings, right. for it to actually get on the train. So that's why we, <laughs> otherwise we wouldn't just have random weights. Yeah, I was like, oh, that's... So she's meant to be getting them picked up and sent to That's so but... funny. Back on another episode of Mitch Ping Parks in 
a spot where he stays over the limit and he hopes he doesn't get a parking ticket. Yes, no parking ticket. Oh, kind of funny that I was just standing in a service workshop with all the mechanics servicing cars and my car's beeping at me to say to get it serviced. Uh, don't worry, I'll, I'll get it serviced soon. Surely, surely it, it can't, it doesn't need to be serviced on the actual day that it says it needs to be serviced. I'm sure there's some wiggle room in there. So it is our uh, lunch break and instead of actually eating lunch, I'm going to go look at some Ferraris. Now, I'm not just skipping lunch because I love Ferraris, well, I am basically, but the main reason is that I'm fasting. So. I'm just, I, I've just finished that phase, if you didn't see my uh, 220 kilo deadlift yesterday. Uh, I've just finished that big phase, so just to take some tension, some stress off my gut, I'm going to do a fast, so about a one day long fast. Now I say I'm going to fast to help my gut. It's, it's basically because I can't be bothered uh, cooking food and spending money, so <laughs> I definitely should have just driven there. I didn't realize it's gonna be so far away. This is not good, I'm, it's starting to rain. Look at this, my friend. We are going for a ride. Okay, trying to hold on to one of these cameras and ride at the same time. Let's, oh, there's a Ferrari right there. Holy shit. Oh my God. What's that, a four? No, that's a California. Oh my God. Ferrari! Why is it beeping at me, bro? Ah! Bro. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna leave that because I have no idea what I'm doing. Now, it's it's been uh, 20 minutes to, to walk here and it's only meant to be a half hour break so uh, let's hope they're enjoying their lunch and they're taking their time because it's just here just here and it's starting to rain heavier uh oh the Ferrari showroom oh my god here we go baby open sesame where's the entrance I don't even know where the, the entrance is to the to a Ferrari I should know that because I'm going to buy one of these, Jesus. There, there's the 488 GTB, baby. Okay, now I actually know there's, there's doors right up here, so I'll come in these doors. Oh my God. Why? Why is the door not opening? I don't understand. Oh, it, li it literally says enter via West Terrace. Well, which one's West Terrace? I think that's the front, right? Let's me let me try that. Okay, I think you meant to enter over here. Hello. Hi. Good, how are you? The super fast, with the super big engine at the front. V12, look at the leather. Oh my God. So I eventually found the entrance. It was it was where I was going to at the start. Um, but yeah, I got in here. I'm very, f not flustered, but oh, just when I'm around these cars, I just become in, I turn into a little boy. Because look how sexy this is. Wow, the red leather. What do you think of that? Dude, this one over here is literally just staring at me. How sexy is this? This is the, oh my God, dude. And look at the engine. Like, that isn't, you're gonna have to get the normal one so you can see the engine. Oh my God, that's just insane, dude. Look at this. Carbon fiber. Oh. Mate, do I even need to say anymore? I don't even need to say anything about this car because it is that sexy. Yeah, 
Yeah, what do you guys think? The white or the red? The red all day. Like, come on. I could honestly stare at this car all day. Oh my God, but I know I need to walk back because it takes like 20 minutes to walk back. Well, maybe I can just drive, drive this one and drive back. Oh my God, my heart gets all giddy when I'm in there. Oh, it's so amazing and luxurious. My heart is honestly like racing. I can't even like in words. So all words distort the truth. Okay, I have no words for how I feel when I'm fucking next to a Ferrari. It's absolutely ridiculous. I cannot wait to fucking own one. Well, it would be like, okay, sit in one or sit in like a new one because I sat in an old one and then sit in, uh, sit in a new one and then drive a new one and then own a new one. That's the, the checklist. Not gonna lie, I'm getting it. Pretty hungry walking past all these pizza places. But the thing is, when you're aligned and you're following, you're living by your values, you, you don't get hungry, right? So when I was in the Ferrari showroom, I did not think about eating food at all. But now I, le I left, and I'm like, oh, I have to go do this now, I have a few more hours. Oh, there's pizza. So, what your brain does, your brain's like, oh, hoi, you know, you don't want to work. What are you, you're hungry. Go eat some food. You're hungry. Go on, go on, go eat. Go and have some pizza. You know, have some ice cream. Because your brain is like, no, 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 that's going to be painful. So from an evolutionary perspective, your body does not want you to endure pain. Your body always wants you to be safe, right? Makes sense. In order for us to evolve and survive, we need to be safe and actually survive and procreate and things like that. So your body's always gonna find ways to make you survive. So you actually crave those sugary, sweeter, higher calorie, highly palatable foods because your body knows, hey, that's a lot of calories, that's a lot of energy for me to survive this stress that I'm under. So what happens is, if you're doing something that you hate, you're gonna look for that instant gratification. So, you start eating the pizza, eating the ice cream, eating this, the pasta, because your body, you're, you're enjoying it, right? Your body and your a human being will never do anything they perceive has more drawbacks than benefits, right? So what does that mean? It means if your body, if you think that instead of working for the next five hours straight is gonna have more drawbacks than eating a pizza, because I know I might get bloated, I might put on some weight if I eat a pizza, but your body's like, no, 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 that's gonna taste really good. Let's do the pizza and, and stop working. So, food for thought. So just, just take note, if you're really hungry, and then you start doing something that you love or your job or a sport or watching show, then you won't need the food because your hunger will go away. So that, that's my explanation of being, see right then when I was talking to you guys, I did not get hungry at all. How's that? That's cool, isn't it? Back in the day, I used to actually do acting classes like down, down there at this, um, this acting place. I think I did it for like six months and then I stopped for some reason, but Actually, I can't remember why I used to want to be an actor. I don't know. I guess <laughs> I've made it now. It's 10 years later. It's five years later, six years later. I don't know. Yeah, but I made, look, I'm on the big screen now. I'm all over Lexus. Lexus social media. That'd be so cool if Lexus posts that on their Instagram or something. Oh, I'd be famous. I'm actually kind of glad that I had to walk all the way down there. It probably took like 20 minutes each way because uh, I don't think I'm gonna go to the gym today. Oh my God, don't tell anyone. Don't tell, Derek, don't watch this. I'm not doing my cardio today. This is my cardio, I'm out in the sunshine, in my, um, in my chinos, my tight chinos, my tight shirt, and my dress shoes going for my cardio walk and buying a Lexus. I just get the exterior.
Just packing up now, we are all done. Wow, what a day. Longish, longish day. I still haven't acting eaten, I'm so hungry. Pack, yeah, acting is hard work. I had so many lines. I didn't even say anything in the entire. Up and down the elevator to get all of our stuff. Almost, this will be the last trip. Yeah, hopefully. Ele elevator gains. Does it fit? Yeah, it's it's too big. That's what she said. <laughs> Was this in here before? No. No? No. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We got more, more stuff, Alvin. What? <laughs> Get a bit better than pillow cover and... Thanks for coming. Here. Done. See you guys. See ya, Michi. See ya. Oh yeah. We're going, we're going down the tunnel. Isn't it humbling filming $200,000 cars and then jumping in your, your commie afterwards? Yeah, the 400 grand. <laughs> it's so humbling. Hold now, on. you're meant to wait for the green. some a green light. Yeah, oh, that's green. Yeah, means green. Wait, the other, other bike's driving. Yeah, I think so. Are just going to follow? Oh, oh my God, this is so cool. No, you can't. You can see the, in the mirror. There's no one there. Go, Alvin. Oh yeah. Beep at him. At us. We just wave it. <laughs> Beep at him. <laughs> really? No. <laughs> 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 He'll come back. What are you doing, bro? Go. He has to be red or some shit. Is there a car there? There's not a car there. Is it red? I think it's red, guys. <laughs> oh, this is so funny. Come on, just go! What are you doing? Also, there is a mirror there. Mirror. Just go! <laughs> there is a mirror there. You see the mirror? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Wait, what are you waiting for? It's not going to turn green. It turns <laughs> green at the top. Look, there's no one there. Can you see in the mirror? There's, there's no one there. I, go for it. Yeah. See, so filming this. And you're, <laughs> and you're <laughs> they were waiting for it to turn green. I'm like, what are you doing? Watching movies? Or something? <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice. So just tell me where I need to stop. It's that's a wrap. wrap. Yeah, that's a wrap. Good work, brother. Um, I'll uh, see the final results. See you next time. Thanks, thanks for the acting. The video as well, yeah. Yeah, thanks for the acting gig. See you, man. That's a wrap. Heading home now. Going to go back to the gym tonight. That's going to be the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you had some sort of entertainment from today's video. If you liked the video, like the video. If you didn't like the video, subscribe and let me know in the comments below what uh, what you liked in the video. Did you like how it went to Ferrari on on my lunch break instead of actually eating food? Because now I'm really hungry. And I'm gonna go home, cook up some turkey, have some rice and really enjoy it. Like I'm gonna have a massive meal and let's hope, actually let's hope I didn't get a ticket because I was uh, much longer this time as well. Yes, no ticket, awesome. Thanks for watching again. Just remember, life isn't that serious. Just go out and get it. Ah. There you go. Oh. Before we've even started.